vaccination. And uh, also, it was Democrats that got you all your COVID checks. Democrats got those. Not one Republican voted for you to get one. That's why the senators in Georgia are no longer Republican. They got voted out of office because every Republican senator, uh, not not every Republican senator, I think all the senators and most of the congressmen voted against the, the country to get any COVID relief. Didn't want it. They've also voted to end your Social Security. They've also voted to end your food stamps for those that get them. Uh, to greatly reduce and make it harder for families with children to get food stamps. And uh, and as my uh, ignorant brother today, he, uh, he texted me during the show, and my ignorant, self-admitted racist brother said, uh, oh, man, thanks to Joe Biden getting the $35 uh, uh, what was the shot they get? The uh, I said it on the show earlier today. Um, the um, the insulin shot. I haven't had my medication today. The insulin shot. Oh, thanks to Joe Biden getting that. And then the, the writing back, I said, "What the fuck's the matter with you?" I said, "You actually complimented Biden." And um, he said, "I was I was giving you a gotcha." He said, "My brother went to uh, my cousin went to get it today, and it was one hundred and twenty seven dollars." I said, well, who do you blame for that? Joe Biden, man. He's been saying for three years he's going to get it. No, no. Joe Biden's got us the $35 insulin shot. For those of us on Social Security and disability, we do, for those of us that need it, do get a $35 insulin shot. He's got disability, man. I said, yeah, mental, I'm sure. But no, I don't know if it qualifies him for the shot. Everybody in your goddamn family's been, hey, he's, he's going to vote for Biden. And we're going to get, I said, well, good for him. Good for him. At least he's going in the right direction. I said, but if, if but let's let's say that you can't get the thirty five dollar shot. There's a reason for it. Is because that nearly every fucking Republican in the vote that we just had, I think it was this year. If it wasn't at the end of last year, it was early this year. I think it was the end of last year. Voted for you not to have access to the thirty five dollar, the capped out thirty five dollar insulin shot. Do you know how much an insulin shot is in Istanbul, Turkey? Well, Turkey in general. But Istanbul is where my son was, and, he, and he, he's got friends over there that, that have to have insulin shots. You know how much an insulin shot is over there? Because, see, we're the greatest country in the world. Don't forget that. Don't forget that. But a insulin shot in Istanbul, Turkey, cost you the equivalent of $2. $2. My brother claimed they were trying to charge him $127. i have heard there's places that charge higher than that. Biden wants it capped at 35 because they still make a fucking shitload of money, as you can see, at $35. There are certain medications that my son needs that run, oh, they run our insurance about $10,000 a month. $10,000. Those, uh, those same uh, uh, drugs that he needs, those same medications that he needs in Istanbul are $90 a month. In the Philippines, are between 90 and 120 dollars a month america america ten thousand dollars a month and i forgot the name of the company it's a very very well-known company uh i'll have it for you the next time i do the show it's, it's one of those companies that everybody knows because my son and his mother have been on the phone with them why is it ten fucking thousand dollars a month here and it's 90 dollars in istanbul and it's called corporate greed and corporate gouging. Um, did somebody finally say something or is it still my lane? Uh, let's see. Blake McChristy says, well, Michigan Mike says hello. Um, nothing is free. Everyone knows that. Well, no, but it can be a lot cheaper. Can be a lot cheaper. Oh, as a matter of fact, Trump wants to implement, he, he wants to do away with taxes in general. Every fucking finance specialist uh, and financier in the world tells you that is an absolute plan for disaster. Because if you tariff the shit out of everything, they're not going to pay for it. China's not going to pay for it. Mexico's not going to pay for it. Just like that wall Trump was going to build that Mexico was going to pay for, that never fucking happened. Trump was actually responsible for building 3.2 miles of wall, and most of that fell down because of shoddy craftsmanship. Couldn't even build 3.2 miles of wall. The other 30 some odd miles of wall that was built was already scheduled to be built under the Obama administration, if you want to do your fact-checking. So you can say nothing's free all you want. It could be a lot fucking better. We pay our taxes for a reason, and our taxes are supposed to help take care of us. It's called Social Security for a reason. Oh, I don't want any help from the government. Yeah, you fucking do, because there's not a goddamn one of you out there, whether you need it or not. 
because there's some of you out there who don't need to take your social. <laughs>